Okay, so the hive's been active now for about three weeks. Uh, I'm probably going to open it up and see what's going on with the queen and the other bees. And I have to put the uh, uh, shorter super on top and put this uh, queen extruder piece, which is right here too. So I got a little work to do this morning. We're going to see how everything's going in there. Now what we're going to do is we're going to lift the top off of here and see how everything's going underneath. Okay, here are all our bees inside. Uh, you can see they're all making some pretty good comb in here and everything else. There's a few dead ones. We're going to move that out of here. Uh, we're going to try and lift up some of these frames, see if we can find the queen in that whole thing, okay? So, just slide these over a bit. And make a little space in here. Use our hive tool. Lift up a little bit on this. These bees just seem to be working on making some comb from what I can tell. Nothing going on here. We're going to slip these back in. Lift this up. Nothing on that side. Some of the comb here. I see there's some honey already being made. Some pollen. Uh, can I tell if those are brood chambers? Can't tell. There's a lot of pollen being placed in here. Don't see a queen there anywhere. I see honey up here at the top though. There's some honey being stored up there. I'll try and slip this back in. I got some honey on the bottom, which we don't want. bees on here. A lot of brood chambers. Mm, some are hopefully emerging from there. I can't really see any Oh yeah, I see baby. Okay, I see uh, them fertilizing inside of here. Okay, there's that's what we were looking for to see if there's the queen's been laying eggs and it, you can see that that's happening so that's good here's another frame we're going to lift this up see again lots of brood chambers there you can see they're making honey right in here there's a lot of the honey being stored uh, haven't found the queen yet See, there's some brood chambers down there where their larvae are starting to grow. That's good. It's very good. I haven't spotted the queen yet. She's in here somewhere, though. Put that back in. Here's more honeycomb. These are very active. Okay. They're all pretty busy here, making home. Still haven't seen the queen yet. Here's the other ones, starting to draw more comb up there. some pollen in there so they're dropping in the pollen it's not really seeing uh, everything in there it's 
Still not seeing the queen though. Haven't found her, but there are larvae, so she is laying eggs. Just haven't seen her. Slide these all back together. Here's a nice bee with some pollen on it. This one with some pollen over there. They all are moving about. So we're going to drop this queen extruder on top. Keep the queen out of the upper portion. Try not to squeeze these bees. They need to move down just a tad. Okay, that keeps the queen from getting into these top supers. Now we're going to place these top supers. This is where the honey should be going into. Center these frames a little better. Inside of here. This makes it a little easier for them to make home and things. I think we can. Close this thing up. Bees are fine in pollen. Larvae are being made, so the queen's laid eggs. So everything seems to be going okay. We're going to seal this up. We probably won't really need to check on it very much now because it seems to be doing okay. That's it. Three week checkup.